Easter isn't just about a bunny or searching for brightly colored eggs, which is so much fun. There's so much more to the story about how the world was saved by God's one and only son. One week, Jesus was celebrated with shouts of praise while riding a donkey through town. The next week, he was crucified with shouts of hate, but that was God's plan. It had to go down. One last meal Jesus had with his disciples, a time of fellowship, of joy, of sorrow, and betrayal from one of them within. He took the bread and the cup, saying, Take and eat. This is my body. And drink. This is the blood of the covenant poured out for many for the forgiveness of sin. Then Jesus went to pray in the Garden of Gethsemane. Father, if there's any other way, not as my will, but as your will be done. Then Judas and the soldiers came to arrest the son. On trial, the Pilate, who found no crime he had done, to please the crowd he had him flogged, but they were enraged. Another thing Pilate tried. He set a prisoner free. Barabbas was chosen. The crowd sentenced Jesus to be crucified. Nailed to the cross, no sin he had committed. Instead bore our sins and our sicknesses and diseases. We are free, we have hope, and a life everlasting, a precious gift to us by Jesus. It is finished, Jesus said in his last breath. He was buried in a tomb, but that's not all that was left. Three days later, he rose from the dead, conquering death, fulfilling the promise, Jesus is alive, just as he said. Thanks to Jesus for this gift that God gave to you and me. Offer love and hope and eternal life to all who believe. Have a happy and blessed Easter.